a six-year-old is old enough to know exactly what was about to happen to him. I want to go out to Kira Morgan. She is the news director of KNPT Radio, uh, joining us from Oregon. Start from the beginning. Yeah. How did this happen? Well, police received a report from 911 that the woman had thrown her child off of the bridge. They closed off the Aquinnah Bay Bridge immediately, and first responders, uh, including the Coast Guard helicopter and lifeboat, immediately started searching those cold waters. It's a 126-foot drop that that child went through into the water. Mm. Clark Goldband, Nancy Grace producer. So, wait a minute. There, there's got to be a backstory here. You don't just walk to the highest point of the bridge and drop your six-year-old off. What's the well, backstory? Gene, I think there's an important point here to bring up that you just heard from the reporter a moment ago. There was a 911 call to report the child had been tossed from the bridge. The 911 call was from the mother herself, Gene. All right, Clark, here's my question. There's always a backstory here. You don't just walk up on the bridge and throw your six year old over at the highest point. Isn't it true that her husband had just been diagnosed with a very serious illness in the last year or so? Yes, Gene, that's correct. And that diagnosis was MS. We know about a year ago, the husband had been diagnosed with MS. Now on top of that, Gene, this six year old child is in fact autistic according to reports so a lot of stress on the family trying to deal with both the husband and the child but gene i think one of the key parts we need to bring up in this story is yes there was a 911 call on the bridge but the person who made the 911 call was the mother herself according to authorities calling them to say she threw her own child off the bridge Law enforcement responds immediately, Gene, and they allegedly have to call the husband, the father of the boy, to try to verify this story. It's probably not often someone calls 911 to tell them they just killed their six-year-old.